Hi y'all! Hope you're having a wonderful day. If you're new to the channel, welcome, welcome. We're a natural healing channel that does some box on opening, some crystal grids, meditations, sound healing, all kinds of natural healing. And we'll be talking later about herbs and that kind of thing. So we hope that you'll want to join us in our community and subscribe to the channel. If you're returning, welcome, welcome back. I sure appreciate you. And I'm glad that you're here with me today. So today, on Natural again, I'm doing uh, two videos before I head off for my surgery. Normally I do my makeup for all my videos, but yeah, you get me straight out of the shower me. Today we're going to be opening the Zen Box. And the Zen Box is a monthly subscription box. It is $39 a month with free shipping. And it says our boxes are curated to help you to connect with your inner magic and discover new ways to take self-love to the next level. Each box is jam-packed with five to seven products, including instructions to create your own rituals. Each month you'll receive a mix of crystals, candles, jewelry, and other spiritual tools valued at $60 to $100. And they revolve it around um, the astrological... Uh, happenings for that month so it's been really interesting to be able to learn about that as well this the last month's box let's do a review of it really quickly before we do this month's box and remember if you don't want to watch the review you can uh, go down to the video description and hit the chapter times to skip any portions that you don't want to watch hope that helps I do value your time so last month's box was the Sagittarius season, and it was um, it had an altar cloth and crystal grid, and the altar cloth was absolutely beautiful. I haven't used it yet, but I intend to. The selenite pyramid, the road opener oil, and I do want to tell you the road opener oil. I did do some research, and it's. Um, with an herb that's mostly found in Mexico and it's to clear any of obstacles. So I did put that in the little vial with the rose quartz crystals and have been using it. It has a lot of cinnamon in it which brings speed too to what you're doing. Then there was the uh, the crystal roll-on bottle um, with the rose quartz crystals that we put the road opener oil in, the rue bath soak, and I will admit I have not done that yet, but I'm looking forward to it. When I come back from my surgery, I'm going to use that for either a new moon or a full moon ritual. Um, the clear quartz points so that you could do your crystal grid with that, the amethyst points for the crystal grid, two ritual candles, a cup and lid which was to make moon water in and then a bath soap bag so it was a great box last month and the products have been wonderful I'm looking forward to this month and I do think I'm gonna really like this box so let's get into this month's box yay oh it looks like our book got a little bit bent in there but here's our book and then all the products are tucked nicely away. Oh, it looks like we have some plastic over the top. And there you go. Now, the one thing I will say about this box is it just arrived and we're into January. Um, it's not the Zen Box's fault because they did mail it out on time, but with Christmas and shipping, I did not get it until now. So this is the December box and it's probably gonna have New Year's Eve kinds of things in it, which is already past. So kind of sad that I didn't get it on time, but like I said, I can't really blame the box themselves because they actually mailed it out on time and it just didn't get here on time. So first we have our little booklet and I have spent a little bit more time now kind of um, going through the other booklets and they really do a good job at um, telling you uh, how to utilize the items to create a ceremony for yourself for the month um, based on the astrological occurrences. And it looks like we are at Capricorn season. So in the book, it does have on the front now, I really appreciate that, that they do get the items that are in the box. Remember last month it said two candles and I actually only got one, but I'm okay with that. Um, so it'll go through the book and it will actually tell you about Capricorn and what that means. 
looks like it has in here um, well, it's going to talk a little bit about some of the things, though I don't want to mention that. But then it also has a section on how to set your goals, like I do, um, using mostly Lunarly. So this will fall right into it. It tells you what you should be doing with setting intentions on a new moon, the waxing moon moving forward and on those intentions, the full moon pausing, observing, and reflecting, the waning moon making adjustments and refining. Um... And then it does go through, it looks like it does say intention setting for the new year. So, kind of sad that it's late, but I still can do it. Matter of fact, I, I did a um, Tara uh, pick the other day, and the Tara that I picked actually said that I should wait a little while, that it didn't say anything, and I should wait a little while and try again on another day. So, I'm still working on my New Year's rituals, so this will work. Um... However, it does imply here that they are doing a live cacao ceremony on January 1st to sign up. Aw, that's sad. I missed it. That would have been fun. Looks like we have stuff that you would use during that live New Year's goal setting live event. But I'll do it by myself and it will be fine. So let's look at what we have, and the first thing that I see is some little cacao discs, and I only know they're cacao because of what I just read. So there's some little cacao discs there, and cacao, remember, um, cocoa is actually made from cacao, um, but cacao has been known to be a spiritual um, enhancer for a long time, and um, most of the time when you make it, you don't put sugar in it, and you make it more of a strong... Um, flavor and drink it as part of your ceremony almost like I drink my teas. So um, let me see if it says anything else about it. Uh, it looks like it's just saying to you know how to make it and that it will be used during the live ceremony they do. So then it looks like we have a little baggie of Clear crystals. Not sure what that would be used for. Again, when you go through the booklet, though, it does give you everything um, and tell you. But those are nice. Those are nice to have. That would be perfect even to put in another little roll-on bottle for some of my oils if I don't use it for what they said. So very nice. Looks like we have a little stir stick. Probably for our cacao. <laughs> Cute little star on it. My happiness journal. And it looks like this is just a lined journal with nothing in it. Could be like your gratitude book for the year, which is kind of nice. So your happiness journal. Probably would use that in the ceremony as well. Ooh, nice. The Llewellyn's 2021 Astrological Pocket Planner. That's nice, and those are not cheap. Um, U.S., it's $9.99. And this is a calendar that has all the different moon settings and the different astrological signs and where they're at. If you look close, you can kind of see on each day. It tells you when they move in, what time, and that kind of thing. Very nice. I actually have another planner like this, so this will probably go in a giveaway box that hopefully I do quickly because I want you to have it as early as possible in 2021. Very nice. I'm excited. That's beautiful. It will get passed on, but that's a beautiful piece to have in there. Oh, pretty. Oh, yum. What am I smelling? Hmm. Oh, clove. Citronella, clove, lemon balm, nutmeg, and cinnamon. Awesome. So the cinnamon and nutmeg for speed. The clove for your abundance. That's beautiful. Look at that candle. Nice big candle. Let's see if I can get you the... 
There you go. Oh, that's beautiful. Mmm, I will definitely use that. Mmm. I don't know. I did just get an Abundance Crystal set that I'm going to be giving out as a giveaway from Cosmic Crystal. Maybe I'll put that candle in with it. Hmm. Maybe, maybe. Then we have a last but not least. Oh, pretty, a candle holder for your candle. Just a beautiful, simple brass candle holder. Put this candle on. Very pretty. Stick that down on there. Very nice. Of course, you got to take this uh, label off before you burn it, but that's beautiful. Very pretty. I'm loving this box. Some really great things to work with, and I'm sure that the online ceremony that they did was wonderful, but I'll be able to do it on my own. I look forward to doing it. What did you think of this month's box? Remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already to join our natural healing community where you can say, karma's my friend. Bye y'all.